Hello everyone, I hope that you're doing well. Thank you for tuning in because this is an experiment. I don't know how long it's been for you. It might have been a couple days. For me, it's five seconds. <laughs> this is the lore episode. Do we get to learn about the founder, Ymir? I hope so. Let's get into this. It was that quick? To me, it seems like the founding titan doesn't have any power because that was really fast. <laughs> Yeah, and this whole bit of Grisha going, I've seen into Eren's memory, Zeke, you need to stop him. Yeah, that's what it seems like. Something awful. That's what he saw? So he's been influenced this entire time. So Zeke still has this goal, even after reconciling with his dad. Oh, ew, 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 ew. Well, to me, she doesn't look like she has emotions. Wow. Something so small and idyllic. So she was just a random girl and slave? Some random slave, I guess. But did she? It wasn't even... She's not even answering. It couldn't have even been her. It was just someone. Yeah, she, it seems like she's taking the blame for it. Oh gosh. Hunted, like, hunted for sport. Oh my gosh. Become somebody who everybody loves. So she took the blame for everybody. And look where they got her, I guess. But there's no Marley or Eldia in this fight. It's just people. A place to hide, maybe? Yeah, a place to hide. Hide. Down the rabbit hole. <laughs> what is that thing? So that's the thing that, that, that gave her the power? Wow. She wasn't even Eldian. Wow. She didn't belong to either or. Those things. Like, not a ribcage, it's the that worm thing. Those stars on his crown are kind of like the armbands that the Marleans make the, the Eldians wear. She took the shot for him? She's always been a slave. And now she's... Dead? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No. 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 So those three branches were her daughters. Even in death, she's not free. She's just always been a slave to the King of Eldia. Always building. Forever. You, 2,000 years of the future. Yumi really did send for Eren. She did. Shiganshin's walls. It's starting. What the? What is that thing? Is that Aaron? It was in his head. It was in his eye in the intro. Yeah. It's him. You're done, Yelena. すべての夢の民に積む。歩み始めた。俺の目的は俺が生まれ育った。Wow. 
この島の外にある全ての地表を踏み鳴らすそこにある命をこの世から駆逐するまで Because I'm just, I'm just shocked. Like, I'm, I'm not very expressive because I am literally shocked beyond belief. Like, even after learning, even after learning that there are good people across the sea, even after learning all of that, he still is just like, no, base, base instinct, protect my home. That's it. He said that when he kissed Historia's hand, when he reconnected with the founding titan, or at least with somebody of royal blood that one time, what he saw was that he was eventually going to destroy the world. That he eventually was going to activate the rumbling and destroy the world. And I suppose there's no changing that future. He gets himself to where he needs to be for him to strike. And that's it, that's all there is to it. This whole thing, all the attack Titan ever was, was Eren. All of Zeke's problems, all of everything can be traced back to Eren. I'd love to know more about the Ackermans, though. Created using Titan science, isn't that like what was said? Basically, to shift without turning. Oh, this is too much. This is way too much. Honestly, I'm just shocked at this point. I'm just like, I feel kind of empty. I mean, it's obvious, like, the season is nowhere near finished. So I imagine that, like, everybody's going to stop him, right? This feels a lot like Code Geass. When Lelouch finally got c control of the world, everybody rose up and defeated him. Is that what's going- I, I feel like- uh, well, I don't- I don't know if I feel like- I want it to happen. Very much so. I want it to happen now. Ever since Aaron interrupted that play, it, it was like, I wasn't really cheering for him. I hope that Armin and Mikasa can, I don't know, put it to rest or something. I just have to wait and see what comes next, really. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe and ding the bell for notifications. You don't have to, but it would be super, super cool if you did. Comment below, please. Um, let me know your thoughts about the episode. Let me know what you think is going to happen next. I don't know what else to say at this point. It's like, yeah, yeah, now, now we're in the end game. So uh, thank you for staying and have a nice day.